Ganeshka doll. Uh, we won't game. Zap guns here, I don't know if they are. Oh my god, I got him! Right. Oh my god, I get it! So yeah! Alright, okay, so yeah, so basically, here's how the storyline begins. Basically, the four soldiers, including Dempsey, go to rescue the agent, which was uh, Peter, who is uh, trying to figure out what they were doing, and which they're do which who they were doing is Richtofen and Maxis. Richtofen and Maxis, by Nact, they were making, well, before Nact, they made the zombies. So, we're just doing a quick relay here of what's going on. Then, the only, and then the four marines make it to Veruk. And, so, yeah, they go to Nak, they don't find him there, they go to Veruk, they find Peter, except Peter's dead. Pretty sure that's how the storyline. Peter's dead, and the marines die, except for Dempsey. And so, Richtofen grabs Dempsey, and he's already grabbed Takeo and Nikolai for the test subjects. They do the 115 experiments, and the thing, okay, the 115 that turned the humans to zombies turned Dempsey, Nikolai, and Tack into super soldiers. So they were uh, magically immune, and that was Maxis's plan in the entire end. In the whole end, he wasn't creating zombies. He was trying to create super soldiers like De like a Tank Dempsey. He's freaking badass, because he is, he's infused with element 115, and that's why they wanted to do it. So, they never knew, they expected this to go that wrong. So then, they go to Shangri-La to find, who they find in Darien? Shit, who they find in Darien? Yeah, they, they didn't, okay, yeah, so they didn't find Peter in Veruk. They, they all died, but Peter hangs himself in Shangri-La. When they get there, he hung himself, and Richtofen's like, nine. So, they go from Shangri-La to Darien, and what happens in Darien is the, the, yeah, Shionuma, they go from Shionuma to Deiris, and what happens there is, in Deiris, the teleporter malfunctions, and they get teleported to Kino, and that teleporter in Kino was supposed to be unveiled on the moon radio, which you hear Richtofen saying, he's like, this teleporter leads to another dimension, so, Kino, Kino happens, now Kino goes to Ascension because... Shit, what happens again? Damn it. Oh, nope, they go... Yeah, Kino... Uh, what about Ascension, Darian? What about Ascension? Yeah, so Darian's saying, once they are in Keen, once they're in, uh... Once they're in Deris, teleporter leads them to call the dead, and then yeah, that I expect that yeah, all right, cool, cool, cool. So then basically what happens is they go to Shangri La, they get the focusing stone, then they go back to Ascension. They help out uh, the guy who's trapped in uh, the Gersh device. The guy. The one guy who's stuck in there and Samantha's trying to get him. So you release him. Oh, yeah. Once you release him from that in Ascension, he brings you to Moon. And that is how you get there. So, basically, what's happening there is, bam, that's what's happening there. Richtofen, uh, all the side missions and stuff, all the radios you can listen to and stuff. So, basically, what happens then is... After, when Moon is going on, Nuke Town is obviously going on. And then after the nukes hit the Earth, transit begins, and we have the four survivors left. Richtofen tells him to four to power up the device. And that, that beacon powers up, I think, pretty sure a teleporter. And Richtofen's able to teleport them to the next location. And the next, yeah, the next location is Dairise. So the next location, Dairise, they power up the other beacon and then they go to they go to buried and here's my thoughts that buried they teleport the last third beacon and i'm pr i don't know i don't know i'm just saying this they may meet up in area 51 i don't know i don't know 
that's possibly and uh and mob of the dead is basically when maxis had first created the zombies and that's why the zombie eyes are red that's kind of the way it is people are like the devil's cr uh, the devil's controlling the zombies. Not really, because Maxis created the zombies. Okay, uh, the end of it all. Here's how it started. That's how it started. How, how it started is Maxis, all he wanted to do was make super soldiers. He put Element 115 in people, effed them up. He put them in Dempsey. It worked. It, it, he made a super soldier. Maxis made it happen. But in return, he made millions of zombies. And his super soldiers, that four, all go the zombies. So yeah, then the hellhounds get created because Rick Toffin locks them in there. Fluffy, it was the uh, teleporter uh, test experiment. Maxis and Samantha go through the teleporter. They get stuck on Moon in the pyramid device. Bam! That's basically. So let me let me let me give you a heads up, everyone. So basically, at this time, all the the call the dead, everyone's dead. Five, everyone's dead. The original characters are presume either on Moon or Area 51 after the nuclear disaster. And if you did Richtofen's way, Richtofen's soul is also in uh, Samuel's now. So don't quite know. Richtofen somehow wants Samuel. I don't know why he wants Samuel. He just wants him. There's got to be something to do with the end with him. Samuel must be able to figure something out to end it. He may be... Know what, know what, know what I'm thinking? The time bomb from the box? Maybe, somehow, somehow, Darian, when you throw down the time bomb, maybe the characters somehow get uh, time back in time, and everything goes back in time, and you're the original characters or something. That's my thoughts, uh, that's what everything it is, the end is near, ladies and gentlemen, that's basically my theories of all that's going on right now, the end is here, to every story, every story, there's a beginning and an end, which I've seen on Treyarch, and I knew eventually there was gonna be an end, and it's all gone up to this point, uh, Rick Toffin's either on Moon, the four original characters are left on the Moon, or Area 51, the, the the four surviving characters, I'm pretty sure all of them will die off except for Samuel because Rick Toffin is kind of controlling Sam uh, Stulinger right now. So I think he's going to make him survive and make it end. So thank you, uh, ladies and gentlemen.